subscribe, like, share, and hit the notification bell for updates. Thank you! Today, I will be sharing with you my fun-filled experiences in the Paradise Island, Boracay. Boracay is situated in the municipality of Malay Aklan. During those times, you need to walk a few meters before you can board the plane. It is indeed tiring especially when you are carrying two bags because you are allowed to hand carry them. The perks of walking towards your carrier is that you can take pictures even if it's risky due to some movements on the ground. But nowadays, airline companies provide shuttle services to avoid risks. A few seconds after we've managed to find our seats, I was curious with the seat belt and the passenger briefing card, so I grabbed those. Anyway, it's important to buckle up, so ask for your parents' assistance if you're just a kid. Manila Kalibo or Manila Katiklan is more than an hour flight, so you can sleep, eat, or listen to your playlist through your headphones to avoid distracting passengers. Boracay is one of the best beach destinations in the Philippines. You can go there by boat or by plane. If you decide to go there by boat, you must board on a vessel from Batangas Port to Katiklan Port. If you'll go there by plane, you can choose Manila to Kalibo or Manila to Katiklan. From Katiklan Jetty Port, Boracay Island is just 15 minute boat ride. In Katiklan Jetty Port, you need to secure boat tickets to Boracay Island via Kagban Jetty Port and from there, you can ride a tricycle to your hotel. There are lots of affordable hotels in Boracay. You can choose which do you prefer, hotels in Station 1, Station 2, or Station 3. But nowadays, prior to your visit, everyone or groups must be booked with a hotel in Boracay, which are accredited by the government, Boracay Interagency Task Force, and Department of Tourism. Our two visits in Boracay were like going to a carnival. Wait, maybe like going to a mall sale. It's packed with tourists. But after the temporary closure and rehabilitation, the island will be accepting a number of guests. We just stayed there for only 3 days and 2 nights. So if you will stay there with such limited time, you must not spend your valuable time doing nothing in your hotel room. After every breakfast, at around 8 in the morning, we made sure to throw ourselves into the pristine waters and play with sands. During our first visit and second visit, Station 2 were very crowded, so we prefer walking to either Station 3 or the tip most of Station 1. But today, Boracay is no more like a carnival or a mall sale when it comes to the volume of tourists entering the island. The government only allows not more than 6,405 guests at a given day. Every day, we spent 6 hours swimming in the beach. Every night, we watched and listened to some performances after a buffet dinner. Unfortunately, these days, after the rehabilitation, such performances which were done outdoors are prohibited. Smoking and drinking of alcoholic drinks are not allowed at the White Beach, as well as dining by the beach. We miss Boracay so much, maybe a few years from now, we can visit the famous island and see what's new in the new Boracay. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, like, share, and hit the notification bell for updates.